A bill for a needed new radio system for a southern Indiana county puts the county's commissioners and council at odds. Uh, last night, the Knox County commissioners presented a $31,000 bill for the new system for the highway department. The council delayed taking action on it. News 10's Mike Grant reports the move now has both bodies at odds over what is right. The radios used by the Knox County Highway Department are old and the federal government told them to replace them by the end of the year. The county worked on the project for months and the commissioners presented a bill for the new system to the county council. It was time to go forward and it's, uh, the mandate is the first of the year. So, uh, you know, that leaves us less than a month. So, uh, you know, we, we, we did go forward, we did what was right, and um, it's just a shame uh, all of a sudden people don't uh, seem to agree with that now. The county council threw the static out over the radio bill saying the commissioners didn't follow the right procedures. You know, everybody sitting in that room last night knew what the process was. Everybody understands, you know, what the laws of the state of Indiana are. And, and quite simply what they did was they went out and, and put the checkbook in, in the red by $32,000. The commissioners contend that the council was very aware of the time deadlines that the highway department was facing and that the delay of the payment was uncalled for. We've been discussing this for months and months and months. Uh, the leaders of our county council have been involved. Uh, this is nothing, there's no new surprise, nothing like that. And, uh, you know, it's just a big disagreement and uh, I think it's a conflict of power, I believe. Oh, everybody's in agreement uh, that we need to do it. Um, everybody's in agreement that, that it will happen. Um, the problem is that the process was flawed. Uh, the decision making was flawed and the result was flawed. So while the council and commissioners continue to disagree, the bill for the radio system will stay on hold for at least another month. In Vincennes, I'm Mike Grant, News 10. The council voted 5-2 to, to hold the payment.